Tracy and I'm a personal stylist and I'm here to talk you through how to create that perfect summer holiday capsule wardrobe so that you can fit it into a small carry-on suitcase. I've created a rail of clothes that works as a capsule. The basis of your capsule are your basic bottom pieces. So I've gone for a white jean, a striped skirt, and a culotte, but you could easily go for a short if you're not a culotte person. The really important thing about your capsule is that all of your tops that you choose then work with those bottom pieces that you've chosen. I've got a black top that's going to go with our culotte and also our jean, a striped top that's going to work with our striped skirt and our white jean, a peach top that works with all three, a print top, if you're daring, works with all three, but if not, definitely with your white and your blue and white. And then I've got some dresses. So we've got some really great outfit choices for that capsule. They'll work into lots of different outfits. Then I've got a day dress. I'm keeping in the same colour tone. So you'll notice I've got a bit of peach in the top, orange in this top, and then when I talk about the accessories, you'll see that there's going to be more orange going through the wardrobe. So this peach dress is perfect for daytime sightseeing, but also can be dressed up when you pop in a little belt and maybe change it from a flat to a heel. I then have a maxi dress, uh, a leopard print that's a bit daring, but it's great when you've got a summer tan. It's got an elasticated waist belt, so when you wear it for evening, just pop a nice stretchy elasticated belt on it and put some red lips on and a heel. But for day, what you can think about doing is using one of your tops, like this black one, layering it over and creating a top and maxi skirt look for your daytime option. So it does give you two variations. Then you want to have some pieces that feel a little bit special in your capsule wardrobe. So I've got a really exciting, again in the same colour family, this is a bit more red, a really exciting jumpsuit that's going to be great for an evening look when you glam it up with heels, but equally what you can do is also ruche up, because it's a tapered leg, ruche up the leg, pop it with flats and after you've worn it for your glam evening out, a couple of days later do sightseeing with your flat and it's a perfect option. Then I've got a really great little statement summer dress, it's perfect for evening if you glam it up with heels, but equally you can wear it during the day with flats or pop it with your white jeans and turn it into a caftan look for evening. So we've got a couple of different options there for your wardrobe and you can see how they all intermingle. Really important to finish off looks is to ensure that you've got the right accessories and finishing touches. I always opt for a bag that has a detachable strap so that it can go across your body when you're sightseeing but can be your clutch bag of an evening as well. And the double whammy with a bag like this is that because it has hooks you can also use it as a waist belt to go with your outfits during the day or the evening so you don't even have to take that extra belt with you. I then take two pieces of jewellery. I've gone for a long one with a peach tone, so it's going to sit really nice and central. Great look with your jumpsuit, with your dress, with your tops. Adds in that pop of colour that keeps that colour story running throughout the whole look. And then I've got a more short, fun statement piece that works for day or evening. The blue and the yellow are great to tie in with that colour scheme that we've already created. The yellow makes a pop of colour against all those print tones. And then the metallic is perfect for that evening option. I then have chosen two metallic shoes. A metallic high heel wedge, so it's great if you've got a lot of walking to do. But the metallic will ensure that it goes with every single item within your wardrobe. Don't be shy about going for metallic for the day because metallic is like a neutral. So I've gone for a metallic slider sandal as your sightseeing daytime option. So you've got two metallic shoes that you can guarantee will work with every item in your wardrobe. I always have a summer hat with me with my capsule wardrobe. Don't pack it, wear it on the aeroplane um, when you're travelling, but it's really important to protect your skin when you're on holiday. I have a little extra piece for around the swimming pool or for your evening. So a really great simple kimono that's again got that colour story in it, yellow from our accessories, peach from our tops, peach in our dress. It works really well for your evening looks, especially when you pop it with a white jean. It can work with any of the top options that you've got there, as well as the jumpsuit. But also, it can work with your swimming costume. I always want to pick a real statement swimming costume to take you through the all week. It's got great ruching on it, so it's really flattering on the tummy. Lifts you up on the bus because it's a halter neck. And the really great thing is it's got lots of different colours in it, so you can really play into your wardrobe. So you can incorporate this with your jeans for a top, with your skirt as a top, 
or you can just wear it around the swimming pool if you want. I've then chosen a really great sarong that can double up with your swimming costume. It can also be worn as a scarf when you're travelling. It will work to lift that peach top of an evening. It works with your stripes because it's a colour pop clash and it also works with all of your evening options as a little bit of a throw. So wear it around the pool as a sarong or a scarf or a shrug. I'll show you lots of different ways to wear it in these images now. The sarong is so versatile that it can be worn in six different ways around the swimming pool but also can double up as a headpiece or a scarf or a cover up. I always pack my shoes and my wash bag first and I've left space for a hairdryer, hairbrushes and underwear. Then I put all the clothes on the other side because these can crease easily so by putting fabrics together it's going to make that space work better for you. Also keep your accessories separate to ensure that you don't catch any of those lovely garments. So everything fits in the suitcase, you're ready for your holiday, you've got your hat to wear on the aeroplane, your bag and a space for knickers and of course hairdryers and brushes and you're ready for holiday. Take care, bye bye!